Mr. Brutal Slayer. <laughs> I'm, I'm talking shit about myself in chat. Mr. Brutal Slayer hasn't even played the game. Um, but here we are. We need to summon today. Uh, not champion training. Although Ice Golem is coming up. I'm hoping we have a 2x for Cursed. But we're doing summon rush today. So I have a few accounts that I want to pull my shards on. Um, but we're going to start off on this account here. And it looks like we need to pull, what, like seven? Let's just pull seven. We're going to pull seven, and then we're going to go from there. I don't actually care about any of these champions. None of these champions are going to help me with anything. But I figured, why not Elva, I get. I mean, Ancora. Probably Ancora. Ancora is pretty cool. And there's nothing wrong with getting an extra Ugo. But on the progressive for Voids... The story is actually a little different. I think I might have to go Sulfurion. And do I want to pull Voids? I don't know. Um, Because Sulfurion could be an excellent champion. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and give it the old college try here. And I'm going to pull... I'm going to do a 10 pull. If no nothing comes from these Voids, if Sulfurion doesn't come from these Voids, then we're just going to go on and... Uh, go back to pulling the sacreds because the point value for the sacreds are a lot higher than the other shards here uh 20 20 i mean aniri plus four aniri you know but no we're gonna stick to what i said <laughs> and we're not going to uh we're not gonna do it guys we're not we're not gonna go back and start pulling more voids that's not what we we're doing thank you for the ugo Oh, we pulled an Ugo, and now we have a 25x uh, chance to pull an Ugo. I know on my main account, I'm pretty close to Mercy because I pulled like a crap ton of um, Sacred Shards. But I didn't pull anything. I didn't get any champions. So we'll see on that account if I pull anything good. But yeah, we're not, we're not doing it, guys. We're not going to go back to the Void Shards. I'm not going to pull some more Voids. You know what I mean? Like, it's not a 2x. It's probably not going to happen. So we're, we're definitely not going to go back and pull uh, more Void Shards. It's just not going to happen. We're not doing it. Come on. Come on. This is the old college try here. The old college try. By the way, they need to increase the size with all the champions that they're adding. They really need... Oh, there's Godseeker. Uh, they really need to increase the, the size of the champion vaults here because it's it's ridiculous that we have so many champions but you know what i mean so that's something that i would request polarium to improve upon and it looks like we overshot i'll be right back okay time to give it the old college try here i'm gonna pull just a few voids here and we'll see where we end up with remember we do have other events to um to save up for and I've started thinking that maybe progressive chances are probably the best way to go about doing these things. Like, so I would pull, like the last video, the last big shard video that I did, I pulled like a bunch of shards for Harima, but it was on a 10x. Shortly after that, they did a 15, they did a progressive chance for her, where it was like 15, 25, or 20 and then 25. And it got me thinking, like I pulled quite a few legendaries, Maybe I should have waited for a progressive chance. So now I'm thinking like, okay, the next time I decide to drop a bunch of shards, it should be during a um, a progressive chance because, you know, a 10x, a 10x in a drop of an ocean is just like a drop of water in an ocean just isn't really gonna, gonna hit the way that I want it to. But um, well, what do you guys think? Do you guys think 10xs are better than progressive chances? Are progressive chances worth it? I mean, kind of know the answer to that already. Um, no, I don't think progressive chances are, are worth it for most players. But all right, this is getting ridiculous. Like, let's let's summon something. Come on, let's get something in. Let's do it. Let's do it. We're we're already close to mercy here. I really want to go back to pulling voids though. Come on, give me something. What is this? What was that? What was that lag? All right, two two sacreds in a dream. My on my main account, my sacreds are drained. At the very at the very least, if we drain these, then I'm gonna be that much closer to mercy. So the next summoning uh 
shard thing we're, we're definitely going to be pulling something but um primals let me see how far in are we we're pretty f goddamn we're already like this far in i mean we're, we're already you know we're already here might as well just keep going right let's just pull just pull like another 10 and we'll see what's up come on I can feel lightning being close. That's the second Demitha. Are you sure the, the 15X isn't on for Demitha? Come on. No. Don't be doing this to me. You're not doing this to me. We'll just... We'll pull... We're gonna pull six more. Just six more. Just six more. Centurion, now you show up... Now you show up after Makage. Now you show up after Makage. That's two... This is three. I'm pretty sure we're gonna go over on the on the points here. Four. Five. I, I can't count. Never mind. We got two left. Pull two more shards. Just two. Just two. Then we'll move on to the next account. Hey, cold heart. I think I think seven cold hearts is enough personally. All right, next account. One sacred in a dream. Come on. And of course, Knight Errant. Let's pull this mythical. Come on, mythical. Oh, we got a mythical uh, blood braid. All right, we have six voids. Let's eat the voids. Who do we get? I wish this guy did a lot more than what he actually does. I, I thought he was a cool and interesting champion. But I've never really used him. I mean, I think I tried him once and wasn't too impressed. And I don't think I've seen people use Beardal Fellhammer. But, like, I, I want him to be good because his kit looks interesting. Hey, it's Kizzle. It's um, interesting enough, and he looks like a cool dwarf champion. So, I, like, I wish he was a lot better than he actually is. Fellhound, your uh, five, quote-unquote, second farmer. I think maybe I saw a screenshot of somebody doing four seconds with him. Did I say minute? Painsmith. And, of course, your lovely 200 until mercy rates right there. You know, you at, at, you know you win some, you lose some in raid. That's just how it is. We did get a bunch of, you know, legendaries in the past videos. So, it, you know, it's, it's, only, it's only fair that they put a cap on my luck, right? And then we're going to do one more 10 pull. Where is it? Right here. And of course it would. Screw it. All right. There you go. Ooh.